Once you've done that, they just type in all the commands again, su, uh, alpine. And what you need to do is you want to type in ui, cache again. What is up guys, Shishi Asi, going to with another video. And in this video guys, I'm going to be showing you guys how to duplicate any application that you see fit. With that being said guys, if you haven't subscribed to this channel yet, please do so not seeing game more videos just like this. Anyways guys, let's get straight into this video. So guys, in this video, I'm going to be duplicating a game called Castle Crash and a social media application called Snapchat. So with that being said guys, here are the things that you really need in this video. So the first thing that you need is a Falzo application, basically a file manager and a terminal and also you need a jailbreak so guys this will not work for you if you don't have a jailbreak with that being said guys let me just go on and install these things real quick and I'm gonna show you the other things that you really need so guys what you need to do is you wanna go on uh, on Cydia so guys once you're on Cydia what you need to do is you wanna go on search so guys go on search and once you're on search you wanna type this in the first thing that you wanna install is Falza so let's go here and install Falza I recommend you get the 64 bit so guys, what I want to do is get this one. So we, th this is the one that I have on, uh, on my home screen. So guys, I want you guys to install this one. Look at the version number and install that one. And guys, the other thing that you need is called App Data. All right, guys. So what you need is to install App Data. And guys, this is like uh, just like the simple way of like trying to navigate through application. And I'm gonna show you guys how it works in a minute. Anyways. The other thing that you need is called M Terminal. So guys, what you need to do is to install M Terminal, and this is uh, by Lower Scotland. So Lower Scotland. I don't know if I said that right, but if I did, please leave a like. And uh, guys, basically, it's gonna be from the Big Boss repo, and the app data is gonna be from um, Hack Your iPhone. Anyways, guys, well now I'm gonna show you guys how the uh, app data works. So guys, when you go on the home screen. So guys, let's say uh, I'm trying to look at uh, some Snapchat information. All you need to do is swipe up on the Snapchat app. It's gonna pop out this information looking thing and you really don't know what it is. Basically, what this is, is just a way to like navigate through these applications. So guys, if you want a Snapchat bundle, what you need to do is you wanna just tap on that. And if you want to go to uh, the Snapchat data, what you need to do is tap on the Snapchat data. So what I'm gonna start off with first is the app called Castle Crash, which is a game. And I'm gonna what I'm gonna do is actually show you guys how to duplicate it. And then after that, I'm gonna show you guys how to duplicate Snapchat, which is the same way of doing it. There's no difference in how you duplicate other applications. It's all the same procedure. So the first thing that you wanna do is get the app bundle of your application. So guys, what I'm gonna do is go on and swipe up on the Castle Crash. So let's go ahead and swipe up. So guys, what we want is the bundle. So guys, what I'm gonna do is go on and tap on the bundle. Let's go here and tap on it. And for some reason, it's not launching. For some reason, come on, are you serious? So for some reason, it's not working for app bundles. But if it doesn't work, guys, it's all, it, it's, it doesn't really matter. Guys, I'm gonna show you guys uh, the manual way of doing this. So guys, when you go into the files application, what you need to do is keep going back, keep going back, keep going back, keep going back. All right, guys, so once you're back, what you need to do is look for private. Let's, let's go on top, not library, private. <laughs> tap on private, and guys, once you're on, on private, you wanna tap on var, and once you're on var, you wanna keep scrolling down until you find containers. And once you're on containers, you want to tap on bundles, and after that, just tap on um, application. And guys, once you've done that, good jazz. Now you want to look for. Uh, you basically want to look for uh, an application that you really want to, you know, duplicate. So guys, what I'm gonna do is actually look for an application that I'm really trying to duplicate, which is Castle Crash. So it's just right there, guys. It's right there. What you need to do now is basically tap on the Castle Crash file. So let's go ahead and tap on that. And guys, once you've done that good jazz, all you need to do now is just basically copy this thing. So let's go here. And all you need to do is just tap on edit. And you want to tap on, you want to select on, on the Castle Crash, that app. And just tap on copy. And guys, once you've done that good jazz, what you need to do is tap on the star icon, which everybody have. So like, just tap on the star icon. And guys, once you've done that good jazz, all you need to do now is just basically tap on applications. Let's go ahead and tap on applications. And guys, once you've done that good jazz, now what you need to do is paste this application in here. So guys, what you need to do is tap on paste. So let's go ahead and tap on paste and tap on paste once again. Boom. And it's basically going to be install, uh, put into this application file um, folder. <clears throat> So guys, once you have pasted the application in here, what you need to do now is you want to go into the app itself. 
Alright guys, so once you have done that good jazz, all you need to do now is keep scrolling down until you find uh, info that P list. And guys, once you have done that good jazz, just extend that. And now what we need to do is change some things in this file. So like the first thing that you want to change is the display name. So guys, you can change this display name to whatever you really want. So like I'm going to just go on and just put some emojis on there just because, you know, it should be something simple like laughs or something like that. Hey guys, once you've done that good jazz, the next thing you want to change is bundle identifier. So let's go here and change that. Let's go here and change that. And guys, this one is not uh, fun, in, uh, fun in games. What you need to do is make sure that you change it to something appropriate. So guys, what I want to do is change it to uh, like plus plus or something like that. And you guys can put anything you want on there, but I, I, I just rather go with uh, plus plus. And guys, what you need to do is change some, some want something else. And uh, so guys, what you need to do is change something else, which is called the bundle on uh, bundle name. So let's go here and change it to another plus plus real quick and boom. And guys, once you've done that good jazz, what you need to do now is make sure that you tap on save. So let's go here and tap on save and tap on done. Done. And guys, once you've done that good jazz, and all you need to do is back out of the files on manager. So let's go here and just back out. Boom. All right, guys, so once you have exit out, now what you need to do now is go into the uh, M terminal. So guys, let's go here and enter the M terminal. And guys, you won't be able to see my keyboard, but look, as you can see right there, the keyboard is right there, but for some reason, it's not showing on here. So guys, the command that I want you to guys to, um, that, that I want you guys to put into this is, the first one is called SU. So like what you need to do is just tap on SU and I don't know, I'm going to I'm going to zoom in so that you guys can see. So guys, on your keyboard what you need to do is tap on return and it's going to tell you to enter the password. The password, the default password is Alpine. So if you have changed your password, then you probably want to, you know, find your password, but if if you don't, haven't changed it, if you haven't messed with a uh, term I am terminal yet, then you might have a password called Alpine. So guys, what you need to do is tap on Alpine and I'm going to I'm going to also put it somewhere in the screen so that you know how to spell it so guys once you have typed in alpine what you need to do is tap on return once again and guys it's gonna bring you with this where it says um var slash mobile slash root and guys right here what you need to do is tap this command and it's called u i c a c h e and guys once you have done that good jazz all you need to do now is just basically tap on return and you want to wait for a little bit until this pops up and if it doesn't if, if this doesn't pop up guys what you need to do is type it right it's always spell the command right because if you don't spell it if you don't spell it right the system is not going to recognize it so what you need to do is make sure that you spell it right so that it can work and guys once this pops up guys all you need to do now is just go onto your settings i mean not onto your settings what you need to do is you want to go onto your home page so let's go here onto home page all right guys so once you're back out guys basically it's going to be somewhere here so guys so this is the original application guys and i hope that the other application is in here all right so there it is guys as you can see right there guys we have the application so let me just uh drag it over here okay uh as you can see right there guys we have our uh name convention and we also have the application so it's not really it's not you you can probably just identify that it's not the same thing but guys it's the same thing so guys what i'm gonna do is as you, as you can see right there it launches just no just like normal and let me just launch the other application and uh, let's go here and launch it up and it, that also launches normal so like yeah you know anyways guys basically that is how you do it so what i'm gonna do is actually just duplicate the snapchat application too cash and then just tap on return and once you have return you wanna wait a minute and then exit out and it finds the other snapchat application which is right here so guys there it goes that is how you you know duplicate the application all right guys so now i'm going to show you guys how to delete these applications so guys what you need to do is uh, some of these applications won't delete so guys as you can see right there snapchat has a, a look basically what you can do is actually delete snapchat but you cannot delete these other applications they don't have any access on it and for some reason i accidentally like duplicated the main version so you know yikes all right anyway so guys what you need to do in order to delete these application all you need to do is that you want to go to falza so let's go here on falza and guys once you're on falza what you need to do is you want to tap on the star and you want to tap on applications and once you have done that good jazz so let's say i want to delete uh, snapchat so let's go here and go find snapchat okay so there there it goes there's a snapchat application and all you got all you got to do is basically tap on delete 
and this is not it guys it's not even gonna delete itself so guys once you have done that good jazz what you need to do what you need to do is go back out and as you can see right there snapchat is still on there so guys what you need to do is you want to go to i am terminal once you have done that good jazz type in all the commands again su uh, alpine and what you need to do is you want to type in ui cache again and boom oh my goodness boom and guys once you have done that good jazz wait a minute and then just exit out and as you can see right there the snapchat application has been gotten rid of and basically ba <laughs> and basically that is how you delete the applications the duplicated applications so guys that will be the end of the video and i hope you all enjoyed this video and if you did please leave a like and if you didn't please leave a dislike thank you again for watching this video tishy i said is signing off in the spot i've been making more videos than i thought I'll be quitting every single week, every day Every day has been the hardest for me But I keep going, yeah, keep going Every time I go in, I try to quit, but I can't Because I'm all about it, I cannot stop about it I love YouTube, I make YouTube my thing I cannot stop and can't, no, yeah